It is so good to see everybody. I am so, so excited to, uh, to put this video out and there's no trick, there's no gimmick. I'm actually back on this channel and I'm so excited to be here. So guys, I've had a lot happen and you know I've kind of disappeared for a while. So what is up and what is going on? If you want a really full breakdown of that, you can go over to Joy Sparkle Shine and make sure to subscribe there. If there's gonna be stuff that might be a bit more personal or later on it's a channel I'm gonna grow and I'm gonna do all kinds of fun stuff like I'd love to do like tarot card readings or aliens and blank theories, that's something you can check out. I'm gonna go into a whole overview over there about what has been going on with me and uh, why I just went MIA. And I'm really sorry to anybody I've worried. It's not ever my intention to worry anybody. It's just the nature of how things are sometimes. Um, well, first of all, I have a brand new setup. Yay, check it out, I love it. Um, this is a little bit bland right now. I was gonna do something completely different coming back and that has all shifted. So to make a long story short as to me being back here, what kind of content am I gonna do? What is going on and what has happened? Um, you guys know what's happened with me and my former company. And over the last, you guys know, I've also been battling chronic health issues. And that's what I did over the last few months and it almost took me out. <laughs> it's not a joke. You can go find the full story over on the Joy channel. Um, and it's been very, very tough, but it's been a wonderful, wonderful experience and situation because it made me face my biggest fears. And guys, I can tell you happily and confidently, my health is on an awesome upswing. I am so happy. Um, also, you might notice I look a little different. So uh, because I've had health issues once again come up, haven't lost as much weight as I wanted to, which is very disappointing, but that's what happens when you battle chronic infections and chronic illness it, and, and chronic inflammation, which has been an issue. But guys, things are on the upswing and there've been a lot of changes. My hair is really short and it's curly. What happened? Well, my hair's always been curly, um, but uh, if you guys had seen the progression of my videos, my hair started to fall out. It has to do with the illness stuff. And as a result, um, it got really dry, really brittle. And so, but then it started as we have been trying to fix me, my hair started to regrow again. So I had hair up here, but then these weird scraggly dry parts, it just looked awful. So I just recently went and got my, pro my first professional haircut and said, get rid of all the gross. Let's just have all the new hair come in. Brand new me. So uh, it, this is what it kind of looks like right now. I'm still playing with it, but, and also if I look a little funny, like my face might look really flushed a lot, still really red. And you guys have seen that before. It's the histamine disorder. We're working on stuff. So I come back to this channel. What is happening? Well, first of all, I have a really, really big surprise. Um, so I will just give a little overview on this, but in being sick, I'm somebody, as you guys know, who've watched my channel, I'm disabled. I don't collect disability, but I am disabled. But I don't have a lifestyle set up to be disabled. I don't have family that can help me. I am living off the charity of an ex who is my best friend and we have a great time together and I'm very grateful for him. The problem though um, is that finance, I still have to make money. So here's what happened and I'm gonna have a video explaining this a little more in detail coming up, uh, but uh, guys, I got a little wealthy this year, a little bit, and it looks like we're, we're going even further with it and um, it's, it's been amazing. Um, I have been trading and investing for the last three years on and off, but because I've been mostly in bed this whole year, except for trying to do a couple stints on YouTube and shortly and briefly TikTok, um, I, uh, I said I have to make money, so I dove back into it, and uh, I ended up doing trading and investing with cryptocurrency, and I have over a $100,000 portfolio, which is on its way to probably somewhere between $250,000 to a million at this bull run. I'd say maybe half a million, right? I don't know, that would be my conservative estimate depending on how things go and where my investments are. And guys, I did this with no income. Um, and I, it, it's changed my life. Basically, here's what I'm trying to understand in my life. I want to be able to manifest instantaneously what it is I need to achieve things, to succeed, and more importantly, just to not be in poverty. And I feel like that is what cryptocurrency, and that's what investing and trading, when you learn it, that's what it does. It gives you the ability to instantly manifest. And you guys know me, my big thing is trying to help people out of poverty, right? Because it's, at this point, you can make $100,000 a year and we're all living paycheck to paycheck. And you guys know how I feel about this and the people at the top of the financial institutions and the political spectrums, it's, it's a criminal. 
It's criminal. You guys have heard me say this for how long, right? And so uh, I've been figuring out in the process of getting really sick and having to face my own mortality, which, you know, this, this happens. Who am I? Who do I want to be? And stimulus, I, I, I'll tell you, here's how I felt about stimulus. I've done some things on YouTube. I've, I've been involved in certain areas of YouTube that were kind of considered drama, and I didn't like doing that. And that was something that I did it, when I first got on YouTube. I, I did a lot of good things, and I'm proud of what I did, but I didn't like that side of YouTube, and I didn't like who I became. But this is what happens when you're in poverty. A lot of times you have to pick from two awful choices. What do you do, right? That's what happens when you don't have money. So I've had to take ownership for that and see that and say, okay, well, there has to be a better financial way so I can live my purpose. But what's my purpose? When I was younger, I was uh, for, for years, for about three decades, I thought I was going to be a singer and I'm a performer. That's who I am. And getting sick, I can't do that anymore. And that all shifted. So who am I? Well, I'm somebody who's always been really good at manifesting opportunities and money, even when I was sick and couldn't get out of bed, right? So what I did this year in terms of everything that I dove into with cryptocurrency and investing, I realized where my passion was. My passion is you guys. My passion is this channel. Now, I love my Joy channel. Don't get me wrong. Those are my ride or dies, and I love them, and they are always welcome here. Hi, Joy Squad. Hi. Um, the thing is, though, I think I was happiest in my life when I was able to help you guys with stimulus. And stimulus, thankfully, is a topic that was going to end soon. And at some point I thought, well, maybe I could go into investments and trading, but I wasn't quite sure, but, but now I am. I feel like one of the biggest reasons that I am on this planet is to educate people about finance and poverty and help you guys get out of it. And here's the thing, you don't have to have a lot of money. You guys know my situation. I didn't have income coming in. Um, but I want to tell you guys my story as to what's happened with me, with trading, and with investing. I've done it right and I've done it wrong. And guys, for literally like 50 bucks a week, you can turn that into millions if you do it right. By the way, I'm not selling you anything. There's no like, buy my program or something. And I don't want you to think this is financial advice because I'm not a CPA, okay? I just want to share the information that... Um, that I have learned and share my tips and tricks with you guys and help get you the information you need to make smart, informed decisions. That's all I want to do. And literally $25, $50 a week, if you are intelligent, you can turn that into a millions and you can retire or create a retirement or start. And that's what I want to do here. So that's what I'm coming back with. And I'm just so excited to be here. I am so, so excited. So guys, if uh, if this is a journey that you would like to go on with me, I would love to have you leave a comment and tell me what you think. Is this something you'd be interested in? Here's something else I want to talk about. So I think I can be confusing to people because I come across, I, to a lot of people, I'm not saying this to like toot my own horn, but I, I think to a lot of people I come across strong and, and intelligent and uh, and very confident. Here's the thing though couple things. Um, I came from a bad background of people not being nice growing up. A lot of us did, right? Um, infer. And there was always this mentality put on me that I wasn't the smart one. I'm not that smart. Like I have, I'm a performer and I have intelligence with people, but I'm not that smart. And that happens to a lot of us. And it especially happens to us as women, right? And of course, then let's, you know, not, not just to mention the fact that this is something that I don't, and I want you guys to understand, I don't think this, but all of the limitations that the media has really driven home over several decades to, you know, make people who are in poverty feel like, well, you're in poverty because it's your fault. You are not that smart or you are a minority, which makes me disgusted. Just, I get so upset about this topic because minorities have been so screwed over in this country. At this point, everybody's screwed over. It's just some people worse than others, right? And I feel like, there's something different that I bring to this channel that I want to bring into your guys' lives to help you understand how to get out of poverty, how to get out of something that's been placed upon most of us unfairly. And that is when it comes to finance, trading, investing, cryptocurrency, a lot of times we just get really overwhelmed. I do it. Oh my God, I don't feel like I'm smart enough for this stuff. No way. On top of the fact that I'm chronically disabled, and when I first started my journey in 2018, I couldn't really even read that well. That's how bad my, my illness and disability was. I had a hard time reading and comprehending information. 
but I come across this way so like people don't see it, right? And a lot of us are in that situation too, especially if you're a woman, because we don't really get much health care, do we? Ugh, you guys know I can go on and on for days about this, but here's what I want to do. I want to empower you and tell you you are smart. You are capable. I don't care who you are. I don't care if you're good at this. I'm not good at math, guys. I got one D minus in school and I've never worked harder for a D minus in geometry. I am not good at logic. These are not things I'm good at. I'm good at people. I'm good at entertaining and having a good time. And I enjoy business. I'm good at business. But the logical aspects, <laughs> no way. Get me, try, get me doing chart analysis a year ago. I had a panic attack. This is not a joke. I looked at that and I'm like, all these green and red candlesticks that looks like Christmas. I don't know what's happening. What are all these lines? I'm done. Brain shut off. I'm not smart enough for this. Don't let this stuff intimidate you guys. I want to be a voice that helps break these things down easy. And here's another thing too. Like, I feel like, and this is what happened with stimulus, right? We have so many voices on this platform when it comes to finance and cryptocurrency, and I'm so glad they're there. And we have a lot of guys who are gonna come at you with real strong, confident energy, and here's what you need to do, and fantastic. I'm so happy we have all of these people, and I'm so happy for our men who are doing this. A, there are very few women giving this information, and B, I think something that sets me apart is, guys, I'm just me. I'm always gonna be me. I am fun, I am hyper, I, you know, I'm very, very girly. Um, I love things that sparkle and glitter, like literally sitting next to me. I've got my Victoria's Secret sense, as I always do. I'm very feminine. And being very feminine, we are taught, this is not our realm. We don't have the mind for this. That's kind of something that's this weird placed about thing when it comes to women and when it comes to everybody else in these situations. So here's what I wanna teach you. You can be good at these things and you can be yourself and you can be whoever it is you wanna be. You can li literally, it's like Elle Woods energy, right? And I'm not even a huge fan of that movie. I like the premise to an extent, but you can be fun and hyper and feminine or come from poverty or disadvantages or be disabled. And you know what? You can do this stuff too. And I'm gonna help you figure it out and I'm gonna help you do it in a very easy way that's not overwhelming because this stuff overwhelms me. So if you guys want to be on this path with me to becoming financially free and go along this journey with me, I would love to have you. So make sure and like the video because it helps. It gets the content out and leave a comment. Tell me what you think. And um, like I said, I am so excited to come on this journey with you guys. I want to share everything I know. And I know a lot of people, you're looking at the situation going, well, that's really nice, Katie, but what am I supposed to do? Because I can't afford anything. I'm on disability. I have tools for you. And I want to show you some things that we can all do to help one another so we can be financially free no matter what your situation. It's so much easier than you think. And guys, next video, I'm going to have a few other videos come out. So these next ones are going to be insanely simple tutorials. I also want to show you my portfolio. I want to go through exactly what that I bought and you can see, you can see where the price is and you can see what some of my opinions are. I'm going to help you break this down as easy as possible. So if you know anybody who's interested in this stuff, please send them my way too, especially if they kind of fall under those categories I've told you about, about just feeling like they don't have the confidence that they can't do this. Because they can, they will, and we're going to help them. And even if you're not in the position where you feel like you can actually do, like, invest, you know what? These are some amazing skills to learn. I'm telling you, I'm obsessed with this information. I am obsessed with the concept that we don't have to live in poverty. And that's all I want to help is give the tools for that. So I'm so excited to be back. And guys, I will say this channel is also going to be based around my health in terms of if I take a few days off or something happens, I am hoping that doesn't happen. I'm doing everything within my physical ability to make sure that I am okay, but I'm still a work in progress. So, and again, if you want that story, go over to the Joy channel. And otherwise, um, I'm just excited to go forward with y'all. I love you guys so much. And if you guys are wondering, um, I'm not gonna be much on the Joy channel. I will eventually come back to TikTok, but I wanna work on this right now because right now we're in a bull market. We are in a bull run. And if we do this right, we're gonna make some money. Again, these videos are for entertainment purposes. I'm not a CPA, I'm not a financial analyst. Um, make sure and do your due diligence. Never invest more than what you have to lose. And otherwise, on with the show. I miss you guys. I love you guys so much. So I'm giving you lots of hugs, mwah, kisses, and until the next video, I will see you soon and let's make some money. Yay! Take care, guys.